This is the Tech Podcast Network. If it's tech, it's here. Jamie Davis, the pod medic here at CES in Las Vegas. I'm here with my buddies at the Tech Podcast Network, our sister network for the ProMed Network, and I'm so excited because there's some really cool healthcare applications and gadgets here at CES. Sponsored in part by Go to My PC. Use their iPhone app to access your work or home computer anytime. Try Go to My PC today with a special 45 day free trial. Visit gotomypc.com and click the Try It Free button and enter the promo code podcast. Hi, we're here in the Verizon booth at CES, and I'm so excited because there are really some amazing wireless healthcare technologies that you all have been watching me know that I've been following this kind of remote technology, which is going to bring specialists, going to bring, bring expert care to people that don't actually have access to it in rural communities, in the backs of ambulances, and a lot of other places. I have Kelton Tumby here, and uh, Kelton, you're, you've got some great stuff here. I love the, just the, the form factor of this, but really, up-to-date video, real-time video over a 4G network. Absolutely. So InTouch Health builds this, uh, this is the RP Express. It's a telemedicine portable device, and we're beaming real-time video over the Verizon 4G network from this device to anywhere in the world where a physician has a laptop or an iPad. And so what we can see here is uh, we have a, a full fisheye camera. It gives you 170 degrees field of view. We've got a hypercardioid microphone, which will give you a very high quality audio session and a full range speaker. And what you can see is that we're, we're currently beaming real time video over 4G. We can attach devices such as a stethoscope or a portable ultrasound and also uh, things like an EKG for vitals monitoring uh, to this device. And we can actually be beamed into it from any kind of laptop. So you see right here, here's my laptop control station. As a physician, I'd be using this interface to control the RP Express. So we've really got a lot of cool things, but you've taken this to another level because actually uh, you could have a, uh, uh, a robot version of this in a hospital setting. And you, were, you and I were talking earlier when we were kind of getting uh, situated that uh, there's an opportunity here for a person to see their family doctor. Maybe they're on call, but they're not going to come into the ER, obviously. Normally, when I'm a nurse in the ER, I call that doctor. I speak to him on the phone, or the doctor in the ER speaks to him on the phone. They never talk to their patient. But there's a lot that say for seeing your doctor's face. Absolutely. And perhaps that doctor has just gone home. Maybe he's at his house, and, and as a nurse in that ward, you want to talk to them. You want to that, just that five-minute conversation to discuss that patient's vitals. Maybe there's something that you want them to see. So the doctor can use our RP7 mobile robot with his laptop that he has at his house to then beam in and do a consultation. Now, so we're going to come back to that. We really have to quick message from our sponsor, but we're going to come back and talk about that. We're also going to talk about when's this going to be available because it's in FDA testing right now, and we need to talk about that too. Be right back. You know, we love to get you content for CES, but you know, We've got to get some sponsors so we can get our hotel rooms and we can get the lights for the cameras and stuff like that. That's why we like sponsors like Go to My PC from Citrix. Great programs that can keep you functional when you're in an event like this. For instance, my desktop at home is working overtime even though I'm not at home. I'm using my internet connection at home. I'm using my computer to do some of the work for me. That's where you're seeing the back channel from is my home PC. And that's the best part about Go to My PC is I can log in, throw my files up on the cloud, download them on my PC using Go to My PC, and then put them in order so you can watch all the great content. So therefore, I'm not using internet bandwidth here, which is pretty darn expensive, and I don't have to worry about hauling another computer around like my desktop, which is kind of big. So. Don't take my word for it, try it yourself. Get a 45 day free trial by going over to gotomypc.com, click the try it free now button and enter in that code podcast. Code podcast will get you a 40 day, 45 day free trial over at gotomypc.com. Okay, we're back here talking about some of the amazing mobile healthcare technologies available from Verizon. And Kelton, we were talking about uh, this robot doctor, you know, the opportunity for a physician from home or from their office to interact with a patient in a hospital or another location. Absolutely. So what you can see on screen here is the RP7. I'm going to use the box zoom interface to actually have a look at the head on this robot. So there you can see me through this laptop control station. And say if I got in a little bit closer, you'd see 
you know, the CES remote physician up there on screen. So that would be me. What I can do now is I'm going to use the joystick to actually uh, move around the head of the robot. I'm looking at the back. I can see the stethoscope there. I'm now going to activate the, the movement system. You can see me turning out of that mirror. And I'm going to drive over and have a look at an RP Express in context. So here you can see the RP Express is mounted directly to the stretcher. And so instead of being stuck in a hospital, we've used the Verizon 4G network to actually put the, put the RP Express wherever the doctor wants to be. So we can be out there in the emergency scene. We can be there following them on the stretcher. And then I'm going to use the robot again to, to see that we can, you know, using 4G, we can be in the ambulance all the way back to the hospital. And all this is actually working on 4G right now. You're not, you're not wired. We don't have hidden Ethernet wires here. This is, com this is disconnected here, right just there. plugged in for power. Right That's there. pretty amazing. And now tell us a little bit about when this is going to be available. It's in testing now? Yep. So we have a, a, a Class 2 medical device clearance from the FDA for our Wi-Fi only version. We're collaborating with Verizon, and obviously we're using their amazingly fast 4G network to bring this, this new technology out into the, the wider world. We're going to be going through an FDA clearance process um, with this 4G version, and that'll be happening later this year. But uh, you can expect to see this kind of thing showing up in hospitals, in ambulances, as we move through that, that regulatory process. Well, Kelton, I want to thank you so much, uh, not just for being here at CES and talking with me, but for in innovating ways we can provide quality health care to our patients in the field. And it really is important to us as paramedics and as nurses to really make sure our patients are getting the absolute best. So I want to thank you very much. I'm Jamie Davis, here from, of course, the Nursing Show and the MedicCast, but with my great friends here at TPN.TV and Geek News Central. And I just want to thank you all for checking this out and make sure you follow up here on what we're doing at TPN.TV. This is the Tech Podcast Network. If it's tech, it's here.